Ja. But anyway, <laughs> um, welcome guys, welcome guys. How you guys doing? This is not gonna be a long, long video. I keep saying that more than once, but guess what? It ended up being like an interesting freaking video. Today we are making this rare concoction and it's called Is this on the fridge or was it out? I just took it out. Oh dear God. Okay. We're gonna make some barbecue hamburger concoction. Yes, guys, this is what happens when we are low on food and we have nothing, you know, to get. So, over here, over here, we doled out the hamburger meat. Yes, it's not all that red, but it's okay. It's still good, guys, because I doled it out for, like, almost 24 hours. And these are my ingredients that I will be using. Some onion soup, some paprika, some parsley, and adobo. Now, guys, I will not be using that paprika and parsley and a devil until the very, very end, guys. So, what I'm going to be doing is... Yes. Damn cats is in the kitchen again. Gifts. Yeah, Gifts. They're in the kitchen. As you can see, they are always in the kitchen when we're cooking. Now we see this one, It's not for you. Neasy boo. You are always in the kitchen every time I'm cooking. I'm going to dump this in here. That shit just fell in there. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> there. I'm gonna mush this up. Don't like I said, don't pay attention to this color right here. It's because it's been sitting in in the refrigerator and out for almost 24 hours, guys. And it starts to do color duration and stuff like that. So it's okay, guys. Most of y'all be like, ew. No, guys, it's still good. Wife well, could tell you, it is. Mm -hmm. um, as long as it's not dark, 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 we're good to go. We're good to go, guys. I'm going to beat this up. This is going to have to simmer for a couple of minutes because it has to definitely get some juice in here and everything. So I'm going to add my onion soup on top. Yes, guys, I'm using onion soup again. Onion soup is my friend. Life can tell you, it's my friend. Yes, it is. It's my amazing little friend. Do I measure? No. I go by eyesight and smell. I think that's good. Okay, so, um, like I said, it, I do not measure. I do not measure. I'm going to add some little bit of parsley to it. Beep, 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 Yeah, I'm beating it, guys. So, um, yep. There. Some parsley in there. And now, we need to sit. Be back with the next portion. Stay tuned. All right, guys. What's up, what's up? I'm adding the paprika to it. Yes, I am. I'm going to add some more parsley to it because the simple fact, it just gobbled it up, as you can see. Do you even see the parsley? No. It's gone. It's gone, guys. So I'm going to add some more parsley. As you can see, it's almost done. It is almost finished. You just let it simmer. It's about 10 to 15 minutes. Right, though? Yeah. 10 to 15 minutes of a cook. Don't take long. If you know how to freaking do it, then do it. Now I'm going to add my adobo. Yes, I know. I added some other stuff. I'm adding some adobo to it to give it more of a kick. Not that much because of the onion soup that was added into it. And we're going to mix this up some more. You see how nice and juicy and greasy, you know, all that meat is in here. The juice, it is crazy. It's so crazy. It smells really good, guys. It's got a nice, distinct taste and a smell. Yes, guys, mix it up really good. Make sure your meat is all the way done, guys. Make sure it's done. Now, this is the crazy part of the meal. Most of y'all probably think I'm crazy. But, you damn skippy I am. Um, this is my way of sloppy showing the food. I add barbecue sauce to it. <laughs> yes, guys, I add barbecue sauce to it. I don't have any more barbecue sauce, but 
I'm going to improvise. Just add a little bit more water to it. And before you know it, it will blend in correctly. And everything will work out. This is the last bit of the barbecue sauce for the barbecue chicken that we made. We had it in the refrigerator. And now we just mix it all in there. Hopefully it works. If not, guess what? It's going to have to. <laughs> yeah. And pretty much, this is the meal. Yes, the sink water is still going. Like I always, never turn it off when I'm doing this. It's okay. This is that rare concoction meal that I'm talking about that we be eating. It's a very good meal. And I like to feed the stove, by the way. <laughs> I'm always feeding the stove. Mm -hmm. And the floor when I cook. Yep. Um, but this is the meal. Like I said, this is a very, very short, short dinner video. I don't even think it's even worth a freaking premiere. So we might just post this up. And if y'all happen to be seeing this, I hope you guys actually enjoyed this little ass freaking video. I hope so. Because this is not even a premiere. This is a quick meal. Simple meal that anybody can make. If I had some sloppy joe can, I would put it in there. But I, for number one, don't like the way it tastes. It's got a very interesting yeah, I don't like the taste. Can taste. And it's ridiculous. So let me tell you the taste and see how it goes. See if it needs any more seasoning. I wish I had more barbecue sauce. It would be better. You know, when you use old barbecue sauce, it doesn't give you that kick that you want. And we ain't got no more. Then you guys know more seasoning. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And what I mean by more seasoning, on your soup, guys. On your it's desk. <laughs> Goodness gracious, I'm clogging up the sink. Okay, let the water go. Alright, so I'm gonna add some more onion soup to it and try and give it some taste and flavor. Man, it just literally just. It. it needs more onion soup, yo. There's really no taste. No, nothing. Because it's old barbecue sauce, guys. And when it's old, it doesn't give you that kick that you want. You know, because you want to add that mm, yumminess in here. And it's just not working. Round two. With this tangy meat on here. <laughs> There it goes. Okay, so we're gonna let this simmer. And there you go, guys. Stay tuned for the mukbang. Are we adding any cheese to it? I'm thinking about it. Ooh, should I add cheese to it? Cheese to it? That sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Looks we'll nice cheese to it. We'll see what happens. I may add some cheese to it. It do sound good, doesn't it? Because the bar, the cheese will actually, it'll be a cheesy bar. Ooh. That do sound good, but I'll fade how it tastes. That's the issue. Hmm. No, guys. Actually, I'm not going to do that. If I do do that, I'm going to do it separate and see how it goes. That'll probably be into the next day of thing. I'm going to add some cheese to make it heat up in the microwave and see how it tastes with the cheese. That'll probably be tomorrow. And if it's really good... I'll give y'all that video. Tester. Tester. One, two, three. With barbecue sauce, hamburgers, and some cheese. But I think it kind of tastes like um the hamburger with the cheese with the freaking burger. I thought it was going to taste like. Yeah. But I don't know. I don't know. But you see, guys, look at all this. All that flavor in there. And Bella is back in the kitchen again. I tell you. Bella. Every time we in the kitchen, they're in the kitchen. 
Begging, begging like they freaking starving Marvin. Guys, you want to know what time it is? It is almost 11.30. And this is done. We just gotta let it simmer some a little bit. And then we're gonna do on my bank. Look at this messy stove. It will be clean later. Other than that, guys, I hope you guys actually enjoyed this. Stay tuned. Peace for out. More. Later, guys.